So I'll just I'll just kick off the the discussion by by some of the questions that that uh, came in, and I think the the main question we're going to talk about are what what are the routes for uh, to getting a, a PhD in 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 Germany, and and while you answer that it would be good also to see what are the routes to get in contact with the supervisor because I can see people are interested in that and that might be different from other systems so please who wants to to uh, start with that one yeah so maybe I can see um, a brief world although I think uh, Martin you can also comment on this uh, uh, how to join your, your graduate school but I, I think in general um, uh, there are um, now, like in recent years, uh, uh, many more graduate schools than there used to be in, in the past. So uh, actually a good road to a PhD is actually to look for, um, for a graduate school and, uh, and, uh, and apply for a, a, a program. And then there is the other the other road is to find uh, a research group and uh, and register for for a PhD without uh, without um, a program. Yeah. So uh, that is a part for the, the the graduate schools. I don't know, Martin, if you want to say something. Maybe just something about advantages and disadvantages. If you apply to a graduate school. Uh, you will be part of a program with some extras um, that you will certainly profit from, um, but you will be one of many applicants. Uh, we, for example, get more than 1,000 applications for around 20 positions. That's really extreme, uh, maybe not that extreme in other places, but still you're just one of many. If you apply to an individual um, head of a laboratory of a group, uh, your chances might be higher. So um, there are advantages and disadvantages. And both routes, I think, should be taken. I completely agree. Uh, I would personally suggest uh, trying to look for graduate schools, especially because there are so many programs that are being started up every day, really. Uh, our institute has its own graduate school now, which was not started uh, like a month ago, you know. Um, I would say it's much... I, in terms of advantages and disadvantages, uh, the advantages balance out more for me because, first of all, uh, as, as uh, you said, Martin, you have this extracurricular programs. Um, you get trained on different techniques and methods that you might not know. You can go to different seminars to uh, get a more broad as aspect of your PhD. Um, you get to meet lots of people, so it's an incredible opportunity for networking within your grad school program um, and also if you do apply sure it's very competitive but if you don't get in then at least through the interview you might be able to get a PhD regardless of entering the grad school or not 